name is Melanie Dexter, and I've been playing with the Vermont Symphony Orchestra for ever. And they asked me to talk a little bit about my instrument, the violin, today. So let's start with basics. What is a violin? Is it a wooden box strung with sheep intestines that you scrape with a horse's tail? Or is it the clear best instrument in the orchestra, but much better than flutes? Or is it a really fun toy for making cow noises? Well, the answer, of course, is it's all of the above. Now, what makes the violin so wonderful? Well, if you look at the roster of an orchestra, the largest section is the first violins, closely followed by the second violins. And as Mae West once said, too much of a good thing can be wonderful. I'm pretty sure she was talking about violins at the time. So what makes the violin so wonderful? Well, I think it's because it does so many things so well. For example, it can play really soft, as in this familiar piece about a size-challenged arachnid being surprised by a downpour. It can also play really loud. In this example, we have another rainstorm. This one's from Vivaldi's Four Seasons. The violin can also play really, really slow. This example is Bach's Air on a G String. can also play really fast, as in the Dance of the Comedians from The Bartered Bride by Smetana. Listen to how high the violin starts out in the Brahms First Symphony. Much later in the same piece, you can hear how low the violin can play. The violin has been around for hundreds of years. That means there's a huge amount of repertory written for it. So even when you're just starting out, you can be playing really great music. A lot of people start out with Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Stick with it and eventually you'll be able to move up to a piece like Baba Black Sheep. decide that the violin is for you, eventually you can play a piece like the alphabet song. If you really stay with the violin and decide to become a professional, someday you could aspire to playing a piece like the Thema or Theme from Zwölf Variationen in C, Über das Französische Lied à vous dirai-je maman. Perfil number 265 by Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. Violins are happy to play alone without ever feeling lonely. This is a piece by Bach written for unaccompanied violin. nicely together too. If you've ever been to a wedding, you probably recognize this next piece.
this brief introduction to the violin. It looks like I've got a couple seconds left, so please enjoy this parting gift. Mm -hmm. 